And thank you. Now to a last minute proposal to fill in Austin neighborhoods with hundreds of ADUs, accessory dwelling units, those small rentals, garage apartments, or granny flats. The call to relax the rules is in front of the Planning Commission right now. The amendment would allow more homeowners to add at least one unit on their property, and those who live near corridors with frequent bus service could add a second unit if they agree to reserve one for affordable housing or income-restricted tenants. KXAN's Alyssa Gord shows us why some homeowners welcome the change. Year over year, we've just seen how it's gotten um, more complicated. Monica Brickley says it wasn't easy to afford a home in Austin where she could install a flat for her aging mother. Even harder when her family grew to five. The worst of all is just the cost has gotten crazier. Um, over the years. The city's process for installing an extra housing unit separate from the main house was time consuming and strained her finances. It doesn't need to be this hard. Under the current draft of Code Next, the city's trying to make it more affordable for the majority of Austinites to install one accessory dwelling unit or ADU on their property. Planning commissioners want to take it a step further, allowing homeowners to qualify for one more ADU on top of that if they make it affordable. To know that, like, I have this property where my mom lives and I have this extra little thing where I could potentially, if I wanted to, build a unit that could help me bring in some extra income for the family. I mean, that would be invaluable. The city wants smaller, cheaper homes and to keep people from being displaced. But that often means more density and extra traffic. Monica says she's all for smart growth. She just hopes it doesn't come with more fees. These tacked on fees and timelines and permitting hoops, they just they affect real people. You're not, you know, you're not sticking it to anybody, you're just sticking it to someone like me. <laughs> Alyssa Gord, KXAN News. One of the primary opponents relaxing the rules, neighborhood associations who say packing too many people into a neighborhood degrades its appeal. They also say it creates more parking problems. The number of homeowners adding an ADU keeps growing. Here's a look at completed permits in Austin from the last seven years. You can see it increased dramatically after a 2015 rules change. That's when the city reduced the minimum lot size for two residences on one property from 7,000 square feet to 5,750 square feet. Code Next would reduce that lot size even more to 5,000 square feet. It also reduced the off-street parking requirement from two spaces down to one and then drop the requirement for any parking space for units within a quarter mile of Imagine Austin corridors with frequent bus service.